Hello guys, Zark101 here, and today we are going to be talking about, uh, well, what I would want to see in the next update in Team Fortress 2. So, let's get into that. Bada bing, bada boom, sha la la da 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 da. Now, honestly, this video is just a guess video. I don't honestly know when the next update's gonna come out. I don't even know what the theme is. We don't, like, I bet you half of us don't even know. But these are the changes to weapons. Changes to weapons, like buffs, nerfs, that kind of thing. These are changes to weapons that I would like to see happen. Honestly, the the first weapon I would want to see it get a change to is the baby face blaster. Now we all know back in the day the broken hitbox and the speedy scouts of Hoy. Now honestly, I didn't know this at the time. I just used it because, in my opinion, it's the my, it's my favorite scatter gun apart from the stock in looks. And honestly, its gameplay isn't bad. You just have to avoid pyros at all costs. But honestly, the Babyface Blaster, I would like, I like that, I would like them to find some ground, like make it, make it like a, at least a little better than what it is now, to give it sort of like, cause, the heck? some of Scout's primaries have gone into the dust, this is the prime example though, cause honestly, I just want Valve to figure out a way to try to balance it, so, he, like, I can use it again without, like, being coughed on, and, yeah, meh. And honestly, I just, like, I want it to come back, because it's an amazing weapon, and in my opinion, it deserves love, despite what it says. And the second thing I would like is the frickin' panic attack. Now, honestly, I never preferred this weapon back in the day, because, honestly, the load of mechanic and shooting it thing, like, the, uh... Beggar's Bazooka, I didn't preferably like that, but I speak for all people, like, the Panic Attack now is just a worst stock shotgun, basically. Now, I don't, I never played it, but I respect the people that did, and I honestly quite liked the people that actually were able to use it, because in my opinion, they actually, they were pretty good, in my opinion. And honestly, like, the Panic Attack now... It's stats, like, they took away the only mechanic to me that made it interesting, that's most people's opinion. It has a, it has a damage penalty and it has a bullet, it has a more bullet spread, that's, that's part of the logistics part of it. But in my opinion, it's basically just a worse stock. Shotgun. Now it can do damage, but you have to be incredibly close, I think, to be at your target. And honestly, I like Valve to at least give back... The Beggar's Bazooka mechanic, because in my opinion, it made the shotgun unique. And if they don't want to change it, well, then I uh, I have a little disappointment with Valve. But anyway, on to the next puppy loving son of a bitch. Woo! Now the next thing I would like is the Hula Long Heater. <laughs> now this weapon I feel like needs something to make it work, because honestly, most people give it crap. But in my opinion, it's a pretty good weapon as it is. It's just, I want people to see, like, I just want people to actually use it again. Because most most of the time, people use it because they think they, they're they afraid of spies, or, well, you know, fucking die heavy. Wow. Whoop-ha! Eh, you. Aw. Anyway. Most people just use it because they're noobs, or they want, they want spies to go away. Which is honestly quite sad, because in my opinion, if you know where ammo is on the map, and you can find it, or if you use a dispenser, because dispensers are like lifeline. It's quite honestly the funnest thing ever for this. And honestly, I hope Valve, I hope Valve does fix, like, change the Hula Long here in a way that it's good. If they change it for the worst, then I'm gonna have some. I'm gonna pull my hair out. Not really, but mentally. Okay. Time to bake these muffins. Something proud. But honestly, the next thing I would like them to do is not really a weapon. I would want them to stay away. Fucking spies! From Pyro. Just stay away from the goddamn Pyro. Do not touch him. Do not even. I mean, you can give him cosmetics, but don't. Like, you can, ch you can nerf him. Nerf him all you want. Please. But. Like, just don't. Give him any other stuff that makes him more annoying to face, please. Valve. 
And yeah, just don't touch Pyro in the fucking slightest, please. Like, don't. You can buff him. This is please. What? Do not give him anything versatile. I mean, I'm not. I'm. It's just it makes them more annoying. <laughs> ah. Anyway. So, anyways, guys, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed my thoughts. Leave a comment down below. I'd like to see what you guys think what, of what weapons should be buffed and changed or changed. And I will see all of you next time. Bye-bye.